And with this, we conclude, conclude the night's pitches. I would just like to congratulate to all the teams. Great job, guys. And what I would really like is to hear just in maybe preferably in one minute the overall feedback from the investors about the quality of the pitches and the, what, what you thought about tonight's performance before we go to the breakout rooms and before you get the chance to speak further with, with the team. So maybe, maybe we can start in order and just hear like the, the, the short feedback. I, I see Asim's camera is on, so maybe we can start with Asim. Yeah, so uh, thanks for putting me in the spotlight. <laughs> no, not kidding. Uh, so a great presentation. Uh, definitely, you can all be proud on yourself. Uh, I, I believe uh, that you're all, all on the verge of, of something. Uh, I guess, you know, some of you are on in different stages with the ideation. Uh, definitely, I would, I would like to uh, say, you know, adopt the advices from all of the investors, you know, for example, to maybe validate some products more, uh, to maybe definitely uh, think about uh, is this business model the right one? You know, for example, you know, you, some of the products are engaging with the B, maybe B2C is way to go, etc. But uh, love the products, uh, definitely put invest more time in, in costs. This is something that investors are uh, really hands-on, you know, when it comes to pitching, you know, you, ne you have to know all of your costs when it comes to, for example, uh, applications. Some of your products are application-based and you need to know to scope out what are the costs for MVP. That's something that, that is like first question because, uh, you know, the investment is, is based on that. Uh, the valuation of the, of the company is based on that. Uh, so numbers, numbers, numbers are something that are, that are really needed here. But kudos to everyone. Uh, I love the presentation. I love the energies. Uh, and, you know, hopefully many of these products will succeed. Thanks, Thanks Austin. That, 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 that's a great comment and great advice to the team. Uh, for the next one, maybe we can go to Adnan. Adnan, what's your opinion? Uh, first of all, thank you all for great presentations. I mean, uh, I've been following some of the teams here as a mentor. So I've been uh, seeing these ideas develop uh, through different stages, stages in, the, in the process. And uh, you've done really great progress. So congratulations to all, all of you. I mean, I, I have to be honest to say that all the presentations really had uh, have been having great level. Uh, so, I mean, in terms of the products, of course, this is probably the first uh, time you're doing some, uh, something like this. I mean, uh, most of you, I would say. And of course, we have some uh, maybe not very realistic uh, product development projections uh, what I've seen tonight. But I mean, that's something, it's part of the game, right? You need to, to go through it and to learn and to try it out and fail and uh, come back and so on. So it's part of the journey, it's part of the process and, and, and that's what you need to feel and you need to kind of go through. And uh, ah, I would like to see some of these ideas succeed, of course, and most of them, I hope. Uh, it depends very much on your enthusiasm and, and the will to, to continue and, uh, and on the execution, right? Which is the most important piece at the end. So thank you very much for a great presentations and good luck with your uh, startups. Thanks so much, Adnan. Uh, next person, maybe someone can turn on the camera to indicate that he's ready for the comment. Maybe we can go to Senad. Absolutely. Uh, thank you guys so much for tonight. Um, when I first heard uh, that, uh, you know, it was going to be at 7.30 at, at Saturday, I was like, oh no, but what about Zvezda Granda? But I was like, all right, I'm just going to have to take it. <laughs> and I had so much fun with you guys tonight here. So uh, I would just like to say that, you know, overall, just great presentations all throughout. Um, for a lot of you, you, a lot of you guys are doing tech that's already perhaps available in different, um, uh, in different places on earth, like in Sweden and the United States and Germany. Don't be uh, afraid to just uh, dig deeper in, into what it is it that they have done themselves. Obviously, context will matter and you will have to adapt it to locally what's happening in Bosnia and Herzegovina but a lot of the presentations here are adaptions of what's already available out there and see what you can learn from those alternatives. And then you also have some uh, presentations here, like the last one here, Excel Web, which was you know, way out there, very futuristic, uh, completely a game changer, obviously high risk, high reward. And I love that as well, like that you're not just, you know, you're going all in for it. And I, I just love to see that. So congratulations to all the teams and uh, yeah. 
Thanks so much, Senat, for being with us here and not watching that and enjoying this night yeah, this with more all fun. of us. Fun, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. Let's go maybe to Meira for the next comment. Yes, yes. Thank you. Yeah. Pity for Zvezda Granda. I think, I think we are having much more fun here. Um, no, I mean, excellent presentations. Uh, great dynamics, great energy, youth. I mean, what else, what else um, do, 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 you, do you need to succeed? So I, I see really a great potential in, in our young people to, to um, yeah, to develop something um, out of their ideas for sure, to develop very good businesses. Um, when I was joining this, I, I, my aim was like, okay, there is this price that we want to allocate and definitely it will have to be one per, one business, one, one idea, uh, one team. Uh, but now I, I think it's going to be really, really difficult. So probably it will have to be allocated to the few. Um, and then what I would also join what Asim said. Uh, yes, I mean, excellent presentations, but please, I think more numbers. Uh, investors want to see numbers. They want to see costs. They want to see credible revenues um, and yeah, return on investments in general. Thank you. Thank you, Mira, for, for the great feedback. Uh, maybe next one, Zora, Zora Pult. Yes, thank you. Uh, you know, there's something called the Global Entrepreneurship Index and, and they say that Bosnia is the least entrepreneurial country in, in Europe. And, and I always wonder uh, when I work with I, uh, with um, IEEE and with uh, Eddie and his team, you know, where does he find all these people? That's really amazing. And uh, congratulations to the uh, to the team, the organizers, of course, and also congratulations to the uh, to the pitchers tonight. I think uh, I, I, we can see progress every year with the quality of, of pitches and presentations. The only uh, little thing you need to improve, like Mera said, and many others, is the numbers. We've been struggling to understand, you know, how much does it really cost? How much money you're going to make? Uh, you know, what are the really hidden costs that you're not aware of? And also, you know, a little bit of resistance that I saw in a couple of teams uh, in terms of, you know, to outsource or to work with other partners, which is, I think, really, really crucial if you're launching a new product on the market. So um, and over, overall, I think uh, definitely better than Sveres de Granda. Uh, and I really enjoyed it. And... Uh, <laughs> Fenad is smiling. Thank you very much, everybody. I really enjoyed it. It was a, it was a good invested time also on my behalf. Thank you. Thank, thanks so much, Zara. And, and I fully agree with you. Yeah. We're improving year by year, and that's great to see. Ned, what's your comment? Well, first of all, I want to thank you and, and thank the uh, participants for allowing me to really give uh, my feedback because I know from my perspective, how hard it is to put something together like this, work for many months, and then uh, present something five minutes that you put so many months and so, so much effort to, to uh, achieve. So thank you so much for giving us an opportunity. And one of the things that I'd like to highlight is that I would really like to see more of why uh, you do this, like on your pers on personal level, like uh, I understand and, and I could probably read through in between lines what you're trying to do with, with um, you know, positioning of this idea, but what is it in for you? Why are you doing this particular idea? Why is it motivating you? Because at the end of the day, investors will invest in, in teams, not necessarily in initial ideas, but they will be looking for the best teams to invest in. And, and the best teams usually have somebody or some, you know, people that are really energized and passionate about it, meaning, uh, you know, challenge what, you know, established norms are, challenge the way we think and uh, have crazy ideas, go for it. Um, th there were a few ideas that were out there and I like that. Have more of those ideas, um, really go for it. And, um, you know, never doubt yourself. I think this is just the first step, no matter what you did tonight, this is going to help you in your career. Uh, you may not see how right now, maybe in the near future, but in the long term, this will help you and this experience will shape your career in a very positive way. Hopefully I agree with that. Thank you, Ned. Uh, maybe we can go to Maya right now. I'm not sure she can hear us. Maya, are you there? Yes, I'm here. Hi to everyone. Uh, hi, Timur, and thank, thank you and your team because we are here 
and thanks for the opportunity to be here with uh, these great teams. Uh, they were very good and uh, pictures and their energy, English, everything are on high um, global level. Uh, for me, I think uh, I think Bosnia and Herzegovina is struggle with uh, good entrepreneurs because we are a country with a lot of uh, challenges. And because that, I think uh, they had very big challenge with scaling their business here because we don't have a lot of people. People and digitalization here are in all very low level. And because that, I'm very proud of them because uh, they have energy to increase. Uh, ideas here in Bosnia, and that is uh, the great value of this evening, I think. Uh, in future, I want to see all of them as uh, success global entrepreneurs, and uh, for me, I will be uh, in future for them to be mentor and for some advice, maybe uh, uh, from side of uh, investors. Thank you. Thanks a lot, Maya. And I think last comment goes to Nelson. Yeah, I can only join with the other investors. I really enjoyed the evening. Even though it's late, uh, I had a blast and uh, I just want to motivate all the young folks here who uh, really impressed me today. They did a great job. They had motivating, enticing uh, presentations. And I really think this is just the start of your entrepreneurial journey. So uh, keep on thriving, uh, keep on uh, improving and just work on your projects or um, yeah, improve on your product or also um, try to think about scaling effects like multiplicators uh, and going route to market. What are your client acquisition and customer acquisition costs and uh, yeah, journey. So um, really chime in on this. I just want to mention that because all of the other invest investors mentioned a lot of key points as well already. And I just want to uh, say thank you to you all and yeah, have a great evening. Uh, Timur, Thanks sorry, so maybe just yeah. one advice from my side, uh, because uh, all of them, uh, they want money for MVP. I think for us, it's very good if you can see some validation uh, or some proof of concept uh, they build uh, uh, with on, uh, on self. And because that I just for all teams, build some uh, proof of concept, uh, try to find some good mentors or some teams, maybe uh, some startups who can uh, help you with that. And for us, it's very, um, it's very good if you can see something in that way. Th thanks, Maya. Thanks, Nelson. Thanks to all the judges and investors. It was wonderful having you here with us tonight. And definitely, I learned a lot from you and I'm sure the teams learned as well. It's, it's a great feedback. Now we are coming to the last part of, of the evening. It's actually the point where we'll go to the breakout rooms and where investors will be able to uh, move from in the rooms and talk with the teams that they're interested in. Of course, this is only optional if you want to. Uh, our goal is to have this, I'm, I'm sure you heard of Future Leader Summit that's taking place in 2016. And we will announce all the results and all the official awards and potential corporations investments in Tuzla. So uh, actually in these couple of days left, I would really ask you to fill in the sheets and to uh, consider a possible conversation with the teams. So now is the perfect opportunity to go to the rooms and just maybe exchange emails with the team and establish a, a connection and, and arrange a follow-up meeting perhaps in which you can like privately just as an investor and a team discuss in more detail some stuff. And I fully agree with you that uh, there should have been more numbers, but as someone who has been involved in this project, and uh, I know that there are a lot of more numbers there, it's what they are talking is backed up with the facts. So I'm sure when they share the screen and they show you their business model, their calculations, their cost and stuff, that you'll be even more impressed.